Welcome back. Well, the Prime Minister of the Bahamas officially opening the Ministry of Financial Services, Trade and Industry and Immigration's virtual symposium under the theme Alternative Dispute Resolution and the Bahamas chartering a new course today. Altamese Runnings tells us that the Prime Minister noted that government is focused on establishing our jurisdiction as a leading center for international commercial arbitration in the Americas. For the past two decades, the Bahamas has been working feverishly to become a center for international commercial arbitration. Minister of Finance, Prime Minister the Most Honorable Dr. Hubert Minnis, underscored in his virtual address at the Financial Services Symposium Thursday that although legislation has been enacted, there's still much more work to be done in order for the Bahamas to become a leading center for international commercial arbitration in the Americas. We are on the cusp of the Bahamas becoming an answer trial model law jurisdiction once the International Commercial Arbitration Bill is enacted. This is a key step to accomplishing our aforementioned goal. We also recognize that for the Bahamas to successfully compete as a dynamic jurisdiction for international commercial arbitration, we must expand our efforts to also include other forms of ADR. In charting a new course, we intend to develop a model which encompasses all forms of ADR and that reflects the strong partnership between government and industry. The Prime Minister pointed out that government fully endorses industry stakeholders disseminating information on the legislative agenda and consulting opportunities in alternative dispute resolution. The government intends to enhance the existing ADR legislative framework through the introduction of legislation that supports international commercial arbitration, domestic arbitration, as well as international and domestic mediation and construction adjudication. The Prime Minister also indicated in his virtual address that Chief Justice Brian Marie will provide an overview of the Office of the Judiciary and ADR and the plans that the judiciary has in incorporating alternative dispute resolution in its procedural rules. Altavis Munnings, ZNS Network News.